Hey, how's it going? Mo again here with Mo'sWebTips.com, and I'm here with another tip. Easy 301 redirect for WordPress. Now, a 301 redirect is, sounds like a technical term, but basically it is just the code telling a search engine that you have moved a page to a different address or you've changed the URL. Okay, so a 301 redirect is the most efficient search engine friendly method for web page redirection. This should preserve your search engine rankings for that particular page and pass it to the new page. If you have to change file names or move pages around, it's the safest option. The code 301 is interpreted as moved permanently. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what I mean. So I have a web address here called, it's a uh, www.redpalms.com slash tropical elopement package HTML. Now, they both look very similar, but if you notice, the top address is missing the E. It was misspelled. So the person that had set up this particular page before, um, before me had misspelled the word elopement. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically redirect this page to the new page, to the proper spelling. And the reason why I'm going to do that is because I want to try to improve our ranking I believe by having the correct spelling in your URL uh, will give us a chance to get you know at least maybe a little bit better ranking although I will say that this page is ranked very well and it's ranked at number three so the reason why I'm using a 301 redirect is to make sure that I pass along all the all the juice from this URL to this one if I don't do a 301 redirect then I will lose the ranking of this page it'll go to a page cannot be found and uh, we don't want to do that because right now Google has it ranked at number three so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how we do this and we're going to use a plugin and the name of the plugin is redirection there are other ways to do 301 redirects but for the beginners which is what I am catering to is we can use this simple plugin it's a redirection plugin and I've used it on other websites and we can use this. So what you want to do is you want to go to your back end of your WordPress and you want to go to plugins and you want to click on add new and then you want to type in redirection and then you search plugins and the name of the plugin is simply just redirection so then what you do is you go ahead and install that. Now the other option is you can download it from the WordPress plugin directory. Same thing, you just you put in redirection, search plugins, and then the plugin will show up and then you'll have to go to that plugin and then download it from there and then upload it. But the easiest way is to do like this. So find the plugin in your backend, install it, and then once you've installed it, you're gonna wanna go to tools and then scroll down to where it says redirection and then you're going to click on that and then this is what you're going to find now these are all URLs that I that have been redirected to new ones so all you're looking for is the add redirection button um, so you're going to want to click on that and if you click on that basically We are just waiting for the page. So right here where it says source URL, you're going to want to put in the existing domain or URL. And then where it says target URL, you're going to simply put the new one. And then you hit add redirection. And then you should get a message that says your redirection has been added. And now this plugin is doing the redirect for you. And you don't have to do any hard coding or going to the, um, you don't have to do a PHP or uh, I think you can, you, can, you can do it in HT access, but that's all technical stuff. We wanna keep it simple, so very simple. And then you're done. The only thing you have to remember is make sure that the plugin is active because if your plugin is not active, of course it will not work. And then finally, 
once I've done the redirection, you want to make I want to show you how we do that in the WordPress page. So here's the WordPress page, and it, you know this is a page that I had I had uh, it had been published before me, and now what I'm basically all I'm going to do is I, I I find the page that I want to redirect, and then right here where it says permalink, you just hit edit. And then all you have to do is change this page right here. So this plugin works perfectly for redirecting pages. Now, why would you want to redirect a page? Well, here's a good example. Uh, it was spelled wrong. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. Another reason that you may want to redirect is perhaps you've changed your, your product and it's no longer called the same thing. Or maybe you're out of something, or you want, or you're removing a page, but you want to make sure that that traffic still goes somewhere. So then you'll create a 301 redirect to send that traffic to another permanent location. Um, and then you basically just hit update, and voila, you have created a 301 redirect. And let me show you how it works. As you can see right here, here we are in Google. And uh, we are ranked number four of three. This is an advertisement. And if you look in the URL, it says tropical allotment package HTML. Now, if I click on this link now, it, has, it sends me to the page that that was at. But if you look up here in the ad ad address, notice that now elopement is spelled correctly so that's the 301 redirect in action and uh, that's it so I hope this has been helpful I'm out